Hi, my name is Mike McGrath. I am a cloud architect at Red Hat, and I've spent the last several months working on a really interesting project called OpenShift. And I've been focusing on a, a subset of that uh, called Express, which focuses on being able to easily onboard PHP, uh, Ruby, and Python applications via standard open interfaces. So basically, the first thing you have to do when you want to create an application is pick a name for it. So we'll call it uh, Demo1. Uh, to create the app, you just run RHC, create app, and then you pick the, the framework that you're going to use. For this, we use PHP. The client tools are now going out to the server. Uh, they're trying to find an open node in which to create this application. And once that's done, the client software will download a templated repo that contains the actual application. And it'll print the Git repository and the HTTP location. In this case, you can see the HTTP location is here we can see that the blank application has been created. It's also created a local directory on my system that I can go into and make changes. So we'll go ahead and change the main home page and we'll put a simple PHP info. To make the changes that I've made locally go live, all I have to do is run a git push. It automatically pushes those changes back up to the remote repo at which point in time all I have to do is go back to my web browser, refresh, and you can see that the new changes are live. If we take a closer look at our uh, locally created Git repo, we can see that there is published data in the PHP directory, but also libraries and other things that we would like to keep private. If I need to do something else like uh, restart it or any of that, I can use the RHC CTL app command uh, with dash a demo one dash c restart to restart the command. It goes out, contacts are, service and restarts it. You can see that it's still accessible. And then the last two things I'm going to show you are a simple uh, snapshot using the RHC snapshot command. This pulls down uh, a remote snapshot including all the logs, any databases that have been created, those things, into a tarball on my local machine. It functionally works just like a backup. And then the last thing I'm going to do is clean up our app. I mean, we'll destroy it again with the RHC CTL app command. After a quick warning to make sure I do want to destroy it, it goes out and it's destroyed. I can refresh on the browser and see that it no longer exists. I hope this has been interesting enough to you that you'll go out and try it. Uh, just go to openshift.redhead.com and give it a try.